He's got the news. Speed run reviews. And some other random Nintendo stuff. The Mike Odyssey Show. Let's go. This is for my people who love discoveries, people who love to do investigative work. It is a discussion video because guess what? I'm clueless. I'm going, I want you guys to let me know what you think this is. I, of course, I will present to you my opinions, what I think it is, my speculation. And it's all regarding Nintendo Switch 2. And it's exciting because if this is true, oh man, oh man, oh man. I'm talking about a patent. It's a legal document. It's real. It's tangible. It's It belongs to Nintendo. And we're going to go ahead and break it apart right now. Let's go ahead and get started because I don't want to make you wait. And well, b before we get started, if, if you are new here, if you have been here for a long time, maybe you have not yet hit that subscribe button. Look at that number. You see that little number there? We're so close to 50K. I, I, I promise all my, my viewers that once we get past 50K, we'll bring in the giveaways back. We'll bring in the tournaments back. We'll have tournaments with Mario Kart, Splatoon, all that fun stuff. The giveaway wheel will be back, which is monthly giveaways and stuff. But once we get to past 50K, we'll get to all that stuff. Really fun uh stuff on the channel coming coming very soon but i need you guys i need to get to 50k so if you can hit that subscribe button I, I i appreciate it thank you so much beforehand and let's go ahead and get started with the video all right so we are here in the patent bill here um you know we're, we're looking at a patent nintendo just released this is uh this happened about four days ago and all it, it was filed on on september 12 2023 and of course released on august 8 2024 now, this patent itself has to do with sound, okay? It has to do with virtual space and virtual sound, okay? This already kind of hints of what this patent could be about. The patent itself is about sound and sound waves, how how far they can travel before they stop and and so much and where do you hear it from? It's, it's all about surrounding sound, right? And so with that, my investigative work doesn't have the, the has nothing to do with sound it has something to do with an image that they put in this trailer representing the actual i would say the 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 device that will be used in in in, in partnership with this sound patent this feature and so i'm going to go ahead and scroll down here to the actual image because when i saw this image yes i read the entire patent but it all is just sound stuff but when i saw this patent right here I, I i just like wait wait okay we have a processor we have a, a storage section we got some image sound output we got speakers we have display unit right and so i'm like hmm this can't be the switch uh it's way too simple there's not a lot there we know there's there's a there's a wireless communication happening here input device it's it's right there this could be the switch this could be something else this could be the actual vr headset who knows but this could be the switch more simplified or this could be the actual vr headset because i'm talking about vr headset i this is what i maybe believe it is a vr headset with the wireless communication to the 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 nintendo switch just like the ps portal communicates with the ps5 it's all wireless the, the game is being streamed over to the ps portal so why not make a vr headset that's also streamed which gives you all the freedom in the world to play the game in vr mode right nintendo already has a wireless vr headset patent that is that is basically new this could be part of it this could be part of the family of patents and we got here right now I want to show you what the actual Nintendo Switch patent looks like. The internals. We have a patent here where Nintendo actually shows us what the Switch looks like. Let me go ahead and see here. First, of course, because the Switch is already out, we can see the actual system, right? And then we see the the way the Joy-Cons attach and and so forth. The back of it, the sides. It's it's all within the patent of the Nintendo Switch. And after that. Nintendo goes a uh, go uh, go goes and shows us the internals of the switch. We got the processor, the RAM touch panel, all this little good information, right? This is the system itself, the screen. But then we look at here, we got the Joy Cons. And this, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's, it's kind of sideways, but you can see here, um, it says terminal, right terminal, left terminal. So this is the actual uh, right joystick Joy Con, and this is the the left Joy Con. Uh, we also have like the right Joy Con has more stuff inside. 
of the left Joy-Con. I don't know why. Maybe this is the Nintendo Switch. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I know why. Because of the, the Amiibo part is here on the right Joy-Con. And so we have, um, this is basically what a Nintendo Switch patent looks like. On the other hand, we have this one, which is just there, right? It's just very simple. I know that this has to do with sound, but this maybe is kind of attached to this, right? And so it will be amazing if we had a VR headset and Nintendo just is kind of patenting the, the software or the feature behind it. The, the feature in this case will be the surround sound, the, the sound that something is creeping up behind you. You know it, you can hear it because you can hear it. And on each side, the same exact thing. And so um, this patent in particular talks about sound waves and how they drop as they move further away and, or even how they get closer and they get more powerful as they, they come near you. And, and so I, I just broke down the pattern for you. That's basically what it is. It, it, it's a sound surround system that kind of it hints at, at, at sound waves, the closer they are and the farther they are away. And but this is the illustration that they are presenting uh, with it. Right. This is like the device. It's a device. Input. The, it's a device that basically is attached to whatever they're talking about in the pattern. So. I have my co-host on the on the podcast, and of course, my other my co-host on the Indie Mania show coming in September, uh, Paul Gale, and and he he actually talked about something very interesting in one of our podcasts regarding Switch Two, and when we were talking about the VR headset, what he said was that it Nintendo could will be a good idea, right? And it'll be actually beneficial for VRs, right, to make it more mainline stream instead of selling uh, a, a big big beefy like expensive vr headset like the the psvr2 right nintendo could incorporate a cheaper version of a vr uh, like a like a cheap version like a it, not very cheap but cheaper that basically its main f functionality is to just just do VR, right? In the, the cheapest way possible so that VR can become mainstream and everyone can enjoy VR from the beginning. It comes in the box with the Nintendo Switch 2. I'm beginning to think about this and I actually, I am on board with that theory and because this is very simple. I know they're not going to give us every little detail of the internals of the VR headset, but this is, this is, this is beautiful, right? The, the actual, um, VR thing here. This could be the, the small version of it. Uh, and also the fact that they are actually working on some headphones that could also work with the actual VR headset. Um, it, it, it's all connected and, and well, we could actually see this happening. So with that, guys, that's the video. I want, I want to, I want to know what you guys think. I have no clue. I'm giving you my personal thoughts and opinions based on what we've seen in the past regarding patents and all. If you hear pitter patters in the ground, that's my dog walking back and forth, <laughs> just walking around me. Uh, but um, yeah, it, it, she's still walking. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. I, I, I really want to know. This is exciting because I can't wait till they show that that trailer for the Switch 2. And if they do show it and, and, and Paul's um, theory that it would be best to get uh, a, a cheaper a cheaper version of the VR included in every he in every system is 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 a good one and it's true then 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 we might see that in the trailer right and even if they have a more expensive VR headset they will still present it in the trailer as an accessory you buy you know so let me know that's gonna do it guys thank you so much for watching you are amazing and I'll see you in the next adventure here at the Odyssey we have our Sherlock hats. I, we are in investigative journalist mode, and I cannot wait to get that switch to in my hands and in your hands. Thank you, guys. Never give up. Journey on. And my dog says, uh, peace. <laughs>